Hello, hooray, let the lights grow dim. Oh, we've been ready. Ready for the rain to fall, just to fall again. Ready for a woman to be born, only to be born again and again and again and again and again.
Get down off the ceiling Joanna Let's see it talk for a while It's been so long since I've seen you And I really need to see you smile I'm standing on my feet so hard to talk when you fly so free and easy either I go up or you come down your high sea of silence it's surrounding me Homogenized 
lost in pasture eyes There's no place like love Behold the formal female Disappearing through the doorway She has dreamed of this Since she was only nine She's never really fought it And now by God she's got it And the altar crouches silently Waiting for the virgin to arrive You can almost hear her screaming Life that will make 
goodbye, Joanna. You can stay with Anne. Give her your keys, please, because she's a real good very significant song because I don't think a song has ever been written on this particular subject before <laughs> and I think it's high time that somebody wrote a song about this woman because this woman has had I think one of the most important roles in the molding of young women's minds of any group of women except maybe the camp counselor let us not discount the importance of the camp counselor. <laughs> However, there is one I think that surpasses even that. And that is the gym teacher. Oh yes, oh yes. Yes, the gym teacher. I hardly know what to say. I hardly know which gym teacher to pick to tell you about. 
Well, there was one, though. There was one who had a very special place in my heart. And she was my eighth grade gym teacher. Her name was Miss Berger. Miss Berger, are you there? Miss <laughs> <Ms>. Berger. <laughs> it still yet makes my heart go pitter pat to think about Miss Berger. I was notorious in the school for my adoration for Miss Berger. But it was okay then because I was, you know, what, what are you in eighth grade? You're 13, 14. It's a phase, you know? And so it's okay. I have to tell you, I have to g tell you a story that is a perfect example of my feelings for Miss Berger and the way everyone reacted to them. Uh, Miss Berger had to teach hygiene every six weeks, you know? <laughs> they take you out of the, you know, off the court and into the classrooms and make you, you know, take hygiene, and nobody likes it. Miss Berger didn't like it. We didn't like it. But um, she, she used to get pretty excited about various aspects of hygiene. <laughs> she had this baby blue ruler. Whenever she got real excited, she'd start whamming on the desk, you know, with this ruler. One day she was getting real worked up about something, and she went whomp on the desk, and, and I was sitting about two rows back. It was as close as I could get in the rush for <laughs> front row seats. Uh, and she went wham, and half of that baby blue ruler went flying into the air and landed somewhere a few rows away on the floor. And without a moment's notice, <laughs> I leapt up out of my seat <laughs> and went crawling on arms and knees over to that ruler. And everybody's going... <laughs> <you> <laughs> And just as I was reaching out to get it, Betsy Norfleet snatched it up <laughs> and put it in her pocketbook. And she sold it to me the next day for $1.50. That's a true story. She could have gotten five. So anyway, here's this song about my gym teacher. It's called Ode to a Gym Teacher. <laughs> she was a big, tough woman, the first to come along that showed me being female. it on my locker and I carved it on my desk <laughs> and I painted big red hearts with her initials on the books and I never knew till later why I got those funny looks <laughs> she was a big tough woman the first to come along that showed me being female but just still could be strong and though graduation meant that we had to She'll always be a player on the ball field of my heart. <laughs> well, in gym class, while the others talked of boys that they loved, I'd be thinking of new aches and pains a teacher had to rub. <laughs> and while other girls went to the prom, I languished by the phone, calling up and hanging. If I found out she was home She was a big time woman The first to come along That showed me being female That just still could be strong And the whole graduation meant that we had to part She'll always be a player on the ball field of my heart And some daisies in the spring Some suggested points for Christmas by me 
Miss Edna Malay. Sign, of course. <laughs> she was a big time woman. The first to come along. It showed me being female meant you still could be strong. And oh, graduation meant that we had to part. She'll always be a player on the whole field of my heart. Here comes the moral of the song. Sticks to teach her like a leaf sticks to a tree. <laughs> One girl who runs the errands and who chases all the balls. <laughs> One girl who may grow up to be the gayest of all. <laughs> She was a big star from the first to come along. It showed me being female meant you still could be strong. And the old graduation meant that we Free! 